Let us pray for the whole Church of God in Christ Jesus and for all people according to their needs. Blessed are you, O Lord our God, creator and king of the universe. You have chosen us from the foundations of the world to be your holy people and to serve your purposes throughout your kingdom in this world. Empower us now by your spirit to live our lives in accordance with your word and be living sacrifices. Father, we thank and praise you for young Bodhi Joseph Leader. We ask your continued protection over mother, child, and father as we anticipate Bodhi's baptism into your kingdom. We continue to pray for all who grieve the loss of loved ones, and we especially pray for the family and friends of Don Newton. We pray for all who are affected by the pandemic, those afflicted and suffering, as well as those who have lost loved ones. And we pray for all who are facing unemployment or underemployment because of this disease, and for all who are affected financially. Bless those who serve in law enforcement and those who are first responders, the doctors, the nurses. Enable them to do their jobs with courage and competence. We pray for a speedy and merciful resolution of this pandemic and that the world would work together to remove this plague. We pray for the health and healing of many in our congregation. We pray for Gail Cooper, Bob and Carla Pelletier, Gertie Wheatman, Annie Reynoso, Amanda, Susan, and David Ower. And we pray for the strength, comfort, and healing of Lou Schumacher, Sam Clark, and Chuck and Faith Cataldo. We pray also for friends and relatives of those in our congregation. We pray for the father of Martin Ramju, for Tom Schumacher, the son of Lou, for Jeff Schneider, the brother of Greg. We pray for Jennifer Brown and David Scott, the children of Debbie Scott, and for the Reverend Ronald Clausen and his wife Barbara, the parents of Rhonda Pagnini. Father, we ask you to be with your church here on earth. Empower us to be living testimonies of your kingship over the world, that people might see our rest and peace in the midst of chaos and bring glory to you. We give you thanks for our nation. We ask you, Holy Father, to grant health and wisdom to our earthly leaders. Be with our president, our governor, our mayor, and all those who govern us. Grant those in leadership who love peace and justice the strength and wisdom to rule with honor. Help us to view and respect all of our earthly leaders as people appointed according to your will and empower us to lift them up in prayer with thanksgiving. Be with this congregation and our preschool. Be with me, our lay leaders. Bless and strengthen our preschool director, Brianna Jensen. Bless and keep our teachers and staff. We ask you, Lord, to use us to bless those who are poor, discouraged, and grieving. Help us to be mindful of their needs during this time and be willing to reach out and to help as we are able that we might be your image bearers to the world. Into your hands, O Lord, we commend all for whom we pray, trusting in your mercy through our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. Amen. And now the Lord bless you and keep you. The Lord make his face to shine on you and be gracious to you. The Lord look upon you with favor and give you peace. In the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit, amen. <laughs>